do you want your Instagram photos to be like this? Fire ass photos? Well, stay tuned and I'll show you using VS Code. Bakit? Bakit parang sales lady ako? <laughs> so wala akong intro, gagawa akong intro. Boom! Pa! Boom! Pa! Boom! Pa! Then text dito. Boom! Pa! Boom! Pa! Yeah! Uh, pa! Boom! Pa! Boom! Pa! Yeah! Ayan na. Malapit na matapos. Okay, tapos na. What's up guys? How's your day going? I don't give a fuck, but today I'm gonna show you how to have a fire photo just by using VS Code. So, bakit VS Code? Kasi gusto ko accessible muna to all people and Lightroom na mamaya naman susunod. And phone muna tayo next time na yung mga computer shit stuff. If you want that, just comment down below. So, diretso na tayo dun. But for now, sa tingin ko parang mas maganda na lahat makasabay. So, VS Code muna. Disclaimer, yan to ako mag-edit, okay? So, papakita ko sa inyo yung edit is the type of edit that I like. Ha? Yun yun. Yun yung gusto ko. So, okay lang naman kung ayaw nyo. No problem. Gawin nyo kung anong gusto nyo edit. So, this is just how I edit my photos dati. Dati ah. Kasi nga yung get lighter na ginagamit kaya. So, before we jump in, I'm gonna have a quick shout out to the guy and to the people that I knew on the SOAR event. At I had a big shout out to y'all Kasi dahil sa inyo, gumawa ko ngayon ulit ng video So, pag nakita nyo ako sa labas, mukha ko famous <laughs> Kasi, basta pag nakita nyo sa labas, don't be shy Say hi, okay na okay lang sa akin Okay na talaga Nervous na ako in that event Pero okay na talaga if you gonna confront me to say hi <laughs> Famous siya! <laughs> oh my god, famous siya! <laughs> Oh, Don't be afraid to say hi. So after ng pag-edit natin dito sa VS Code, I'm gonna give you some tips kung paano pa magkaroon na fire photo or ma sick awesome photo para hindi lang sa pag-edit at uh, you have tips too. So, you got the bonus. So, okay, bago pala tayo mag-jump in. Yes, jump in. Um, i-download niyo muna yung VS Code. May link sa baba. If you don't, if you don't want to click the link, just Pake search the VS Code on the App Store or Play Store. Sige, I can't wait. Na ano man ako, sige, let's go! Let's jump in! Bam! So, we are here now in my phone. As you can see, there is VS Code Lightroom. Susunod na yung Lightroom and kung gusto nyo, uh, susunod na din sa um, laptop Lightroom. So, okay lang yun. So after you download the app, so go to the app, sign in, log in, do whatever you want. Then import a photo. You can you can just tap the add button here, and basa yon memes yon. Pati wala pa nakita sa yon. Basa you can add and import the photo, and you will see on your dashboard on the studio. So nandito na. Ito na yung mga photo na papakita sa yon. So dalawang filter or presets yung papakita sa yon. Una yung cold tones. Tapos the second one is warm tones. So, una muna tayo cold tones. So, punta tayo dito. Tap the edit button. And, bakit? Ang pagnabasin nyo, mas madami akong presets or filters kaya sa inyo. Kasi free yan. Hindi ko lang kung free yan sa pagkita mo ngayon. Pero ito, as of now, free yan. You can just go, click, go back, and back. Um, press the upgrade button. Then, scroll down. At the bottom, you can see this available to you now. So the All of the Dogs preset is available for free. We are the creator are free. A4 to A6 presets are free, and HB1 and HB2 are free too. So get that, download that. Okay, you need a Wi-Fi or a data to download that. So go ahead. You can have that for free right now. As soon as possible, kuni nyo na. Hanggan nyo yam pa. So, kasi gagamitin natin isang mga preset dun. So, go back to the photo. Press the edit button. Then, let's go edit. So, the first one, kasi nga, di ba, sabi ko, i-cold tones natin. So, i-cold tones natin using by HB1 or HB2. So, kahit ano dyan. Um, kahit, kasi yung HB1 parang brighter and HB2 is darker. So, so kahit ano sa HB1 or HB2, um, HB1 is just brighter than the HB2. So you can pick either of them because HB1 is just brighter and HB1 2 is much darker. So this photo has a sky. Pag ginamit natin HB1, magiging brighter lahat. Magiging 
nakita niyo yung gitna, parang naging hindi nakikita yung mountain which is ayoko kasi dapat makikita yung mountain ayun yung another tip kung may subject kayo sa poro nyo kunyari kayo give more details and then the background kasi mas paganda tignan nyo ayun yung filter na gamitin natin HB2 and press it uh, lower, it, lower it to 8 to 10 or between them I'm gonna go 9 kasi ayoko masyadong itaas ayoko masyadong gamitin yung full filter pag full filter kasi may contrast may yung talagang filter na merong fade makikita nyo sa poro like yun na yung yun pag ginagawa ko gusto ko lang yung parang color ng filter so binababa ko siya so yun press the edit button the second button so dyan mo na ilalagay yung sinasabi ko kanina contrast yung filter yung fade kasi parang gusto ko mas makakontrol natin so okay sa so, exposure exposure nakataas na yun pero bababa natin so ito yung original so pag tinasin natin mawawala yung bundok so gusto ko lang gusto ko lang ng mas darker so gawin natin negative 1 para mas okay yan exposure negative 1 Contrast Ayan o, no, diba kanina mayroong contrast yung mountain Ngayon, kanina, ngayon wala kasi binaba ko lang yung filter Yan yung purpose kung ba binababa yung filter So ngayon lalagyan natin contrast Gusto ko ng One lang Kasi Another tip uh, is Huwag masyadong Uncontrast or Contrast masyado yung picture Kasi yan mo, nagmumukhang Mukhang hindi na picture mo Mukha ng ano faded film o kung gusto mo yun ikaw pero ito na mamukha na din parang faded film na filter so kung gusto mo yun eh ikaw pero sa akin uh, gagawin ko lang as much as possible natural kasi mas maganda kapag yung mga yung mga titingin ng pictures is more than dun para nakikit parang kasama ka yun din another tip ang dami ko na kagad tip ha. kailangan yung pictures na ipapost mo kung gusto mo ma maangas sa pictures is parang kasama yung yung titingin is parang kasama sila so yun another tip so tapos tayo contrast adjustment so kahit ano adjustment na gusto nyo you can straighten then this out so you can flip it if you want pero akin is uh, okay na ako naka straight na yan eh so x ko na lang so sharpen so sharpen is just alam nyo na yan sigurado ako if you zoom in parang faded pa siya onte pero kapag tinasa mo yung sharpen nakikita mo yung edge ng body ko wow body yeah <laughs> so nakikita mo sa bad sa edge ng body ko or kung ano man parang may linya lumalabas ayun yung kasi to give more details to separate the subject to the background so yun kung gusto nyo um, kung masyadong blurry yung picture nyo gawin nyo ng, lagyan nyo yung sharpen pero kung gusto nyo ng parang calm tones which is yung goal ng filter natin ngayon kasi cold so di natin lalagyan ng sharpen so saturation alam nyo na yan it gives more colors and it gives out yun lang yun so gagawin natin lagyan natin ng kulay as you can see diba pag nilagyan mo lang sa 1 may kulay na kagad lahat so gawin natin 2 Okay na ako dyan. Swak na ako dyan. The, look, the poro is looking nice. Sick. Tignan mo, diba? Yun pa lang. Okay na. Ito, okay na yata sa akin. Ito, pwede ko na yata ang post. Pero sige, let's, let's, let's go to the second tool. So, gusto mo makita yung mountains. At the same time, ayaw kong gawing faded. Kasi nagiging fade yung mountain. Ay, nakita nyo. So, gagawin lang natin is one. Okay na ako doon. Yung sky, hindi na masyadong blown out. So, okay na. Skin tone, alam nyo na yan, skin nga, nakasulat na yan, so nag lang yung skin mo. Okay na ako dyan, I'm not gonna move anything there. So, Vignity, Vignit, Vignita, Vignity, Vig, Vigita, basta yun. Ako, gusto ko lang yan, pero at the same time, I don't want the, I don't want it to cover the mountains. So, I'm just gonna go with 1 lang, or 1.5, okay na ako dyan. So, grain. Ito, madaming gumagamit na itong grain is just to have the poro like a film type poro again, like that. Nakikita nyo na. Parang nagkakaroon ng noise. Kung gusto nyo yan, kung gusto nyo film type poro, hindi yan. Pero ako, yoko kasi gusto nga ng calm. Calm yung ginagawa natin ngayon sa filter. So, wala muna tayo nyo. So, fade. Ito yung sabi ko nila, fade. Pag nakita mo yung mountain, 
Ayun na, nagkakaroon ng parang white filter. <laughs> so, <clears throat> so again, if you want to have a calm photo or white photo, add a fade. Pero, magaya na ito, may background kasi ayokong makover yung background. Nakikita mo nyo naman. So, lalagyan ko na ng 1.5 again. Halos lahat yata dito 1, pati 1.5 ban yun. Basta, so, hindi, hindi natin unlock yung borders, HSL. Okay lang yan. Kasi gusto nga na para accessible to all, hindi mo kailangan bilhin. Okay, accessible yan sa'yo. It's free. You know, you have a fire photo and it's free. Diba? Take it or leave it. So, ito okay na to. Fire photo na to. To save it, ito, ito magandang tip. To save the presets, kasi kunyari, pag sinave ko yan. So, gusto ko ilagay yung same filter presets na ito, dito. Madali lang yan. Imbis na gagawin mo, ulitin mo dun sa kabila o sa another photo, you can save the presets just by doing plus. So, eto nga, isa nga lang magagawa mo. Pero okay lang yan kasi, kunyari, meron akong presets kagaya nito. Just hold it and then you can delete the preset and then add, add the preset that you want to add. So, save again again. So, okay lang yun kasi nandyan naman yung photo mo. As long as nandyan yung photo mo, you can save the presets and delete the preset as you want or whatever you, or whatever you want. So again, press it and then press the preset button on the third button and save it again. And ang ganda. So parehas sila. Diba? Or you can do this. You can click the three button on the bottom right corner. You can copy the edits and then paste the edits here. So that's the cold tones, okay? So that's it for now. I think kasi matagal na masyado yung video. Sorry. Kahit kasi ako ayoko na matagal na video. Okay lang yan. I'll edit here and it will, it will have a next one. Kasi papakita ko pa sa inyo yung warm filter or warm presets kung paano ko gawin. Now the tips, okay? To have a fire photo, you need to have an extra effort, okay? Lagyan nyo na effort yung pictures nyo. Hindi lang basta click, click, click. Lagyan yung effort like sa kagaya kanina. Di ba, yung, yung unang picture na in-edit ko, yung mountain na kita. Kung wala ako dun, oh, maganda yung mountain. Di ba, maganda yung view na makikita mo sa mountain. Pero if you have the effort na pumunta dun, tas papicture, magpa-picture ka sa friend mo, ayun, kagaya na kanina, na isa middle ako, you'll have another effort or parang maangas na pic mo. Di ba, hindi lang sa mountain, kasama ka pa. Mag mga sen like the more effort that you put in on the photo kahit anong project yan or kahit ano man or anything the more it will have or be a great project or photo mas magiging maangas yung picture mo have the time or have the effort to add more spice to your photos so that's the first one so, so the second tip is wag kang magpe-picture ng masyadong madilim or masyadong expose. Ibig sabihin, pag mag-picture ka, kung type mo na picture na madidilim, okay lang, but you need a light para mapunta doon sa subject na yon. Kahit sinong photographer man yung sabi mo, kahit gabi, kailangan ng light source. So, kailangan mo talaga ng, ng tamang picture, yung natural lang as much as possible. Para pag in mo, maganda ka kalabasan. So, the last step is, be creative. Lahat ng photographer o kung sino man yan o tao man yan, magugustuhan lahat ng photos mo kung naging creative ka. Like, you're adding an another rule on the game. Another another skill. Basta yun. Pangit kasi kapag may kinag inagaya ka na eh, diba? Um, pa, pa, basta ang pangit pag repetitive yung ginagawa. Kaya pag nakita niyo yung recent Instagram po, uh, shameless shoutout, uh, shameless tag. So, you can nakita yung Instagram ko ngayon para nagiging iba na, nagiging surreal and dynamic na yung picture ko. Dan dati kasi dati parang portraits lang, di ba? So, add a spice on your Instagram or lahat ng pictures mo kung gusto mo maging maganda. Kasi the more, di ba sabi ko kanina, the more na you think about the photo, the more you give the effort, the more you give the creativity on it, mas lalo magiging maganda yung picture mo. Okay, so that's the video guys. I hope you learned something, you know. Susunod na yung next tips and next preset or filter, na warm filter. 
Just comment down below kung gusto niyo na susunod pa. And here are the photos that we just made. Okay, you can do that just by doing the ginawa ko ng tutorial kanina. I hope you like it guys. Naayos ko pa yung intro. Wait lang. Next time na lang yun. I hope you like the video. Paulit ulit ba? Kasi yun. And share it. Share it with your friend. You know. Comment down below kung anong gusto nyo makita sa sunod. Para matulungan ko kayo if you want. Just comment down below. Balay mo. Alam ko. May alam pala ako nyo. Next time. I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye. Bye. Pero no